Have you ever wanted to know what font was used in a JPEG or maybe you outlined a font, can't remember the name of it? Well, this is huge retype beta is gonna save the day. Let me show you how it works. All right, so here I am in Illustrator. So go to Window, down to Retype Beta, open this up, and here's the Retype Beta panel. So now just select any graphic. Keep in mind, this is a JPEG. So with this JPEG selected, I'm gonna go over here and click Enter. It's gonna analyze those fonts. Thinks that's a font? No, but these are, this is type that it recognizes. Look at that, actually selects it. I can take a look at all the different options over here or potential matches. And then if I wanna use it, right, I could just select that and click Apply. What does it do? Well, it gets applied to that text. So we'll exit out of retype and double click on this text and change it to really anything that we want. Isn't this amazing? If we take a closer look at the retype panel, it's actually showing Adobe fonts and fonts from your uh, desktop is what's happening. So we could do that with a number of fonts, but we could actually take that a step further. So we could do that with images, makes it really easy to like apply that font to the, the design that I'm working on. And that's great for images, but what if you have text that's already outlined? So here we have this text. It's already outlined, right? Made a while ago, who knows? Can't remember the name of that font or anything, well, will retype beta help us out? Just click enter, it'll jump in, do its best to determine that font, and it does. It's dispense script right there. But still do that same process, right? Applying that, and it will convert it to that dispense font. And sure enough, it looks like it pretty much nailed it. But isn't this impressive being able to take a JPEG, even outlined font, and use that font? for your next project. So impressive what you can do with the retype beta. Check it out today. It's amazing and let me know what you think.